Turn off like the top spin. Break in TT, ladies and gentlemen. Alright. Now let's get to the other one. Let's assemble it. There's the Hasbro's engine gear, which I am using, and the metal grip rubber. It is all used up, unlike the excellent one, which I'm keeping like that, like it. I'm keeping it in excellent condition, and this one will be in use, obviously. Okay, apply the CW metal grip into the spin gear, engine gear, turbo, snap it in. Here's the blade base, final clutch base for Dragoon GT. Oops. And this one is Takara. And why? Because he has this authentic numbering logo here. As you can see, right there. If you ever look closer into a plastic, especially Takara brand Beyblade, you would find this in number encoding. That's how you, you'll know it's authentic. Okay, let's get that into focus. Okay. Right, engine gear. This. Oops. Close it. Okay. Now, apply the 10 wide weight this on it. Apply the okay. Let me just get to how to remove the attack ring. Let me just go ahead and apply the dragoon bit piece. This is the the dragoon bit piece that comes with that usually comes with for dragoon GT when you especially when you get like new in package or new in box. Yeah, this is the bit piece for dragoon G from dragoon galaxy, which you can get. For like a great price on eBay, especially new box and Takara branded. Oh, it looks good. All right, let me, let me show you how to properly remove the bit chip without any trouble. First off, let me let me just first apply this to the attack ring, and let me just save you the time to show you. Okay, there you go, Takara 2003 China, and there's no Hasbro there. Just a ATBB tree TX. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Now to show you how to properly remove the bit chip. First off, basically you must first, obviously, just do this. Do not try to uh, remove the bit chip like this forcibly, like this, which is obviously the wrong way. And plus, you you just lose the bit chip. And possibly hurt yourself in the process if you like facing it in your towards your direction. So it's yeah, you'll just probably hurt yourself if you remove it like this. And plus, you could possibly break it and then lose the bed chip, obviously, which is mostly the reason you'll just lose the bed chip if you force it out like this, which is obviously the wrong way. All right, just how to properly remove it, just basically flip it over. And then put your index finger to either to either of these sides, like this side or this side. Do not put it in the middle because most of the time, oh, it's rare. But especially for plastic, you could possibly break the bit chip if you put it right in the middle. So it's best just to keep your index finger right here on the bit of the side. And then there you go. Bit chip has been properly removed the right way. Now let me go ahead and apply the attack ring. There you are. Now turn this clockwise because it has a left spin. For right spin bay blades, it it's counterclockwise. All right. Now let's go on dragoon back again. Snap it in. There you go. This one that right here that I'm showing you right now 
is for use condition for battles and this one right here I have it's for to keep it in near mint condition even the rub the metal grip rubber is very good very in excellent condition very nice now let me just go show you how to launch it oh and you, and you and you're probably wondering where were those like tools those winder tools but well, don't worry ladies and gentlemen I have them okay here and here they are let me just get them out real quick and here they are ladies and gentlemen I do have both of the turbo winder turbo winders obviously when you look at this one it's the Takato one because of the Japanese lettering here very nice turbo winder there's Dragoon Dragon Hood I'm only missing one eye sticker there's the other eye sticker and there's I'm missing one of the wings no, oh no not wings but uh, like the blue sticker here okay you can go ahead and look at that let you folks have a good look alright ladies and gentlemen now for the Hasbro one of course oh, it's, it's Hasbro because it has the no Japanese lettering take a good look at it And of course, when you apply them, you apply them right here. Go right here. Attach them right there. That's how it would look like when it's the turbo winder is attached to the CW. Let me apply the other one here. Here's how it would look like. Look how smexy. Okay, let me get to the other one. Whoops, that one fell down. <laughs> Sorry about that. Alright, now let's go ahead and wind it up. And as you may see, on both of these turbo winders, it's pointing, it's going left. So obviously, you should go ro wind it up left. And once you hear that, like after sound, just stop because you could possibly break the the gears inside the engine gear turbo. Just re just remember that the gears inside the engine gear are plastic. So be cautious about that. And just once you hear that after sound, just stop. Uh, since I already wind it up, let's go ahead and launch it, shall we? Now here's the like the left launcher, the standard left launcher for Dragoon, only and only for Dragoon only, because mostly Dragoon has this left spin gear. However, you can't apply this launcher to a left spin gear, if, and you, yeah. If the Beyblade has the left, have the has the less left spin gear, especially even if it's on the right spin, just simply remove the right spin and attach the left spin gear to our, to the right side Beyblade, and just yeah, 
you can spin it left. As long as it has the, like the left spin gear for it. L shooter. Let's take a look at the launcher right there. And there is ways to how to you know get grip with this. Let me just insert a rip cord. Okay, first of all, let's go to the rip cords. Now here's like a, the standard dragon rip cord for dragoon. Dragon rip cord. I'm on, but it's more of a dragoon rip cord because it's a dragoon like. You know, oh boy, my phone's running out of battery, so I better plug in my charger. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry for the inconvenience, but I had to keep this review going. There we go. 